Good evening and once again welcome to my YouTube channel Pia Sony Brazilian International Mark Bano Sakamoto and in this video I want us to discuss about sectors and I want us to go through several examples in this video to express in the type of questions that can be asked under this subtopic. What is a sector? A sector is a region of a circle um, whose perimeter is an arc of the circle and two radii. That is a radius, that is a radius. This is a sector of a circle. And of course, a sector is x over 360 degrees of the whole circle. What do we mean by this? Therefore, the area of a sector is again determined by the angle at the center, which is x out of 360 pi r squared. That is just an easy stuff. And I want us to explain using the same knowledge example 7. Find the area of the sector shown. Find the area of the sector shown below. And of course it goes without saying that is an arc, that is a radius, that is a radius. This is 7 centimeters, this is 7 centimeters, and this is 65 degrees. And the area, of course, as we have understood, is the angle at the center, which is 65 degrees, out of the total possible 360 degrees of pi 7 squared. Of course, pi 7 squared, you would know that um, this is, we have to talk about pi times 49, which is 6. 7 squared, of course, times 65, everything divided by 360, and you will talk about 27.8. This is 27.8 centimeter squared. That is the area. You just have to substitute the variables uh, and the constant given. The angle at the center, the total angle possible, pi r squared. That's how you get the area of a sector. And in the same video, let us talk about example 8. And in example 8, we are, we are supposed to find, find, the, find the angle marked x degrees. And this angle marked x degrees is at the center of a circle, x, radius 5 centimeters, 5 centimeters, and the area is 12 centimeters squared, the area of that particular sector. And it goes without saying, the angle at the center, x, out of the possible 360 degrees, uh, pi, r squared is times 25, this is what is giving us 12, because this one is the area of the, the sector of a circle, and we have the area which is given in the equation as 12 centimeters squared, and therefore we talk about, um, we talk about 25 pi x out of 360, is equals to 12 over 1. Again, making x the subject for the formula, we have 12 times 360 all over 25 pi. This is going to give us x. And let's just calculate this. 
12 times 360, of course, that is 42, uh, 4320 divided by uh, 25 uh, pi. Uh, this is 12 uh, times 360, 360 uh, over um, uh, 12 times 360 which is 43 now divide by 25 and divide by pi again you get 55.0 degrees so you realize that x is 55.0 degrees uh, to one decimal place or to three significant figures having said that um, it is important to note that the formula for the area of a sector is simply the angle at the center over 360 pi r squared, which should give you the area. And in the same video, let's talk about example 9, so that we'll have discussed everything there is to be known in the sector subtopic. Find the radius of the sector shown. Find the radius of the sector below find the radius of the sector below find the radius of the sector below and the sector is just like this we talk about uh, the angle at the center is 70 degrees there is the radius there is the radius and of course there is the area area which is 50 centimeters squared it goes without saying that 70 out of the possible 360 times pi times r squared it should give you the area of 50 centimeters squared so if you uh, deal with this you clean it up you're going to have 70 pi r squared over 360 is equals to 50 of course over 1 when we cross multiply we're going to make r squared the subject for the formula to be equals to 50 times 360 all over 70 pi so if you would want to get now the radius the radius itself is the square root of 50 times 360 all over 70 pi and this is just a matter of the calculator uh, 50 times 360 which you get to be 18 thousand uh, 18 thousand divided by 70 again divided by pi you get 81.85 and it is this now 81.85 you find its square root so the square root of answer is 9.05 so the radius is 9.05 centimeters of course to three significant figures and that is where we are so again we have been able to uh, to find the angle we've been able to find the radius we have been able to find the area of a sector of course using the same approach that the area of a sector is x over 360 pi r squared this one has given us uh, how to approach uh, how to calculate the radius and how to calculate as well the area and of course the angle at the center so once again go to to my youtube channel pearson and exile international math subscribe and share widely and let us work together all right